Let's clap our hands. Oh, magnify the Lord, for He is worthy to be praised. Oh, magnify the Lord, for He is worthy to be praised. Magnify the Lord.
the rock when we call he will answer because our lord lives how many of you believe jesus is alive today we as we get ready to partake of communion we remember once more what jesus did for us he came into this world he lived for us he suffered for us he died for us he shed his blood for us he gave up his life for us but then 3 days later he rose again and he is alive today and he is alive forevermore he is our master he is our savior he is our lord he is our king he is our everything he is the rock of our salvation this next song says he is our master jesus is our master right let's sing it He's master savior coming king he is good to me creator of everything he is good to me and when i'm down feeling low He's good, good all the time. He healed my body and he healed my mind. No better friend you will ever find. He's good to me. Oh, he's good, he's good, he's good all the time. He healed my body and he healed my mind. No better friend. Good. 
say he is good to me. It's not just good. The Lord is good. But he is good to me. It's a big difference. A lot of people believe God is good. But they have not experienced the goodness of God sometimes in their life. The psalmist says, taste and see that the Lord is good. Oh, how many of us have tasted? Oh, let us be thankful for having tasted the goodness of God in our lives. Let us express our thanksgiving and also our love to Him for doing so much for us. He is our everything and He has done everything for us by dying and rising again, rising again for us. He has finished everything. He cried out saying, it's finished. He has demonstrated His love in the highest, greatest possible way. And the only appropriate response is not only thanksgiving, but we love him back with all of our heart. I love you. I love you. I love you, Lord, today because you care for me. In such a special way And yes, I praise you I lift you up And I magnify your name That is why my heart is filled with
I worship you. I worship you with everything within me. I worship you for you are the great, most wonderful God, worthy of. Oh Lord, I worship you. Oh Lord, I worship you. I worship you. I worship you. righteousness and holiness who's perfect in all of his ways he's perfect he's glorious he's awesome 
His ways are higher than our ways. His thoughts are higher than our thoughts. Oh, we praise you, Lord. We worship you, Lord. We praise you, Lord. We love you, Lord. Because you first loved us. You first loved us before we loved you. Before we even thought about you. In fact, when we were sinners, when we were your enemies, when we acted against you, you loved us. You first loved us. We think about your first love. Especially as it is expressed on the cross of Calvary. The climax, the climactic expression of your great love toward us. We don't need any higher proof that you love us, Lord. The cross is enough. Help us to realize that the cross is enough. That what you did on the cross for us is enough. That you are enough. Jesus who died and is now risen again and alive forevermore. You are enough for us. We worship you. We exalt you. In our hearts, in our minds, in this church, you be lifted high, we pray. We praise you, Lord. Continue to minister to your people, we pray, as the service proceeds. Continue to pour out your spirit, we pray. We welcome the Holy Spirit in our midst. We say, have your way in our midst. Fulfill your plan and purpose. Help us to see the risen Lord Jesus, the glory of Jesus and the love of the Father toward us. Come to the rest of this time into your mighty hands, O Father. We pray you will lead us through your spirit. To you be all the glory, honor and praise. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You may be seated. We're going to partake of the communion right now. We're going to first serve the communion inside and outside. When everything, everyone is served, we'll ask all of you to stand together. And together, we'll observe communion. Until such time, please take the wafer and the wine and wait until everyone is served. And then we'll all stand together and observe communion. <coughs> Do this in remembrance of me, Jesus said, of his death, why it happened, what it has done for us. The ordinance has been given to us so that we will never forget the cross and uh, all that the cross has brought for us. The blood of Jesus has been shed there, washes us from our sins. We are blood-sprinkled people, blood-washed people. We are under the protection of God's Son's blood. It's like a fortress round about us. No evil can touch us because God has raised the wall of protection around us through His blood. Think of all the benefits and the blessings that has come to us through the blood of Jesus. Think of all the benefits and blessing that has come to us through the broken body of Jesus. The Bible says that by his stripes we are healed. So today, appropriate by faith, not just eat and drink as a tradition, as a, as a ritual, but as you eat and drink, but appropriate by faith, everything that the cross of Calvary has provided for us. Let's pray. Loving Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, we come. Thank you, Lord, for the cross. Thank you for the blood that was shed for us, the body that was broken for us. Everything that happened there was for us. You didn't die for your sins, for there was no sin in you. You died for our sins to give us a great salvation, to give us the blessings of God, to bring us everything that was missing in our lives. And so we look upon the cross today and, and as we eat and drink in remembrance of you, we today also appropriate every blessing of Calvary, claim for ourselves everything that the cross 
has brought into our lives. And I pray that everyone will partake of it in that way, not just traditionally, ritually, but in a meaningful way, appropriating, enjoying, receiving by faith all that the cross has brought for us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Cannot compare to the glory of your love. There is no shadow in your presence. No mortal man would dare to stand before your throne, before the Holy One of Heaven. It's only by your blood and it's only through your mercy Lord I come I bring an offering of worship to my King no one on earth deserves the praises that I sing Jesus may you receive the honor that you're due Oh Lord, I bring an offering to you I bring an offering to you The sun cannot compare to the glory of your love There is no shadow in your presence No mortal man would dare To stand before your throne Before the Holy One of Heaven And it's only by your blood and it's only through your mercy, Lord, I come. I bring an offering of worship to my King. No one on earth deserves the praises that I sing. Jesus, may you receive the honor that you're due. Oh Lord, I bring an offering to you. And I bring an offering of worship to my King. No one on earth deserves the praises that I sing. Jesus, may you receive the honor that you're due. Oh Lord, I bring an offering to you. Oh Lord, I bring an offering to you. And oh Lord, I bring an offering to you. Oh yes, Lord, an offering to you. Jesus, I bring an offering to you. Oh, an offering to you. Oh, I bring an offering, Lord, to my King, Lord, to you, O oh Lord. I bring an offering. You alone deserve it, Father. Oh, I bring an offering to you, my King, Lord. Oh, Jesus, you, Lord. I 
bring an offering of worship to my King. No one on earth deserves the praises that I sing. Yes. Jesus, may you receive the honor that you're due. And oh Lord, I bring an offering to you. Oh Lord, I bring an offering to you. You, my King. And oh Lord, I bring an offering to you. 